Hey guys, this is Mr. Get Freaked. Now, what you see is this is me just talking in front of my camera, and nothing more special be doing what's happening right now or with the scenery. But if I do this, see this kind of give a cinematic look or a professional look to your video. So in this video, I'm gonna tell you that how you can add cinematic black bars to your video. So without doing any further ado, let's get started. Before starting, I would like to say that. It would be much appreciated if you subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so that you never miss any single update from my channel. So without any further ado, let's get started. So now we are in Adobe Premiere Pro. This is method number one. So first of all, you need to import your clip, then create a new adjustment layer. Select the adjustment layer, drag it, and put it above your clip. Now go to effects panel and search for crop. Then select it, drag, and put it on the adjustment layer. Now you can see in effects panel that crop effect has been applied to your adjustment layer. Now effects control panel, scroll down and stop when you see crop. Then in top and bottom variable, you will select the level 12 because it is the standard level of cinematic black bars. But you can set it upon your own choice like I always set the bars from 6 to 8. In this shot, kinda takes most of the place so the shot I am gonna use this is 8 or 7 or 6. Actually it depends on which one suits better. Now I'm gonna show you the second option. For this, you need to go to Google and search cinematic black bars green screen. Then go to photos tab and download which one seems to clear to you or which one's resolution is more better. Now import that image to your Adobe Premiere Pro and put it on the sequence above your clip. Then scale this thing, then go to effects panel and search for Alta Creek. Then select that, drag it and put it on your image. Then go to effects counter panel, scroll down to Alta Cree and select the eye drop tool. Then drag it over your screen or green screen and right click on it. Boom shakalaka. The green screen has been removed and now you can see your clip with cinematic black bars. These were the two methods. Personally, I like the first one cause in the second method, the black bars are kind of pixelated. In method 1, the black bars are clean and fresh because in method 1, it is adjustment layer but in second method, it is only an image. If you use higher resolution image, the bars won't be as pixelated as this one. For that, you can create your own green screen black bar in Adobe Illustrator or Adobe Photoshop. If this video hits 100 likes, I will make a video of making green screen HD black bars. So that's it for today. Hey guys, I'm Mr. Gatsby, singing now, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.